Hello, I'm Jay Gardner, president of NetIQ. Hello, I'm Jay Gardner, president of NetIQ. And uh, I'll, start that. I'll start at that over. I want to do that over. The focus of NetIQ, no, I, I want to say the one thing, sorry. Hi, my name is Jay Gardner. I'm president of NetIQ. Wait, look, I'm going to start that's that over. That's a good talk. Okay, but that... haven't hit that one yet, so that's a good one. Okay, so I want to invite all of you November 2nd to the 5th, 2014, to Salt Lake City to BrainShare 2014. Okay, don't say 2014 twice. Okay. I want to invite all of you November 2nd... Se- I'm going to start over. I want to invite all of you on November 2nd to the 5th, 2014, to Salt Lake City, Utah, and enjoy BrainShare. That's good. Thank you. It's nice and quiet in here. You got some extra insulation, don't you? Yeah. All right. Starting at the top again. And it's... At NetIQ, we are relentlessly focused on making our customers successful with our security and compliance and identity and access management solutions. You can learn... (laughs) Jay, you're president of NetIQ. What's NetIQ's one thing? Well, Emmett, let me tell you. In fact, let me tell everyone here in Orlando about it. Last year, my one thing was being number one. And this year, my one thing is being a young guy with old hair. Hi, Jay. It's hard to say something now. I only want to say thank you for the help and support you had provided to our customers in Latin America. Always, you were available to meet and talk with our customers. Sometimes it was easy conversation to clarify and explain about product roadmap company strategy. But in some cases, harder conversations as we had, for example, with Vale in Brazil about the audit process. Your commitment as the top executive made the difference. I wish you the best to you and your family and hope to see you soon in the road and expect to see you in Brazil. Jay, I just want to take a few moments, say a few words. Um, just as a reminder, I've known you since August of 1997 when you were my hiring director. Um, it's been a pleasure working for you and with you over these years. I learned uh, a ton from you. Um, you're an inspiration for me. Great Christian, great dad. Um, you're very sincere and genuine, and I try to model myself after you. Uh, both in my work ethic as well as in my personal life and spiritual life. I want to wish you well on this uh, retirement. Get some rest. Um, Enjoy your time off. I know you're not done. You'll find something else. Um, So take care. uh, Keep in touch. And uh, let us know what uh, what Jay's doing. Uh, Wish you well to you and your family and Sally. Take care. So I think one of the things that really strikes me about you, Jay, um, above and beyond things like your your sense of humor and your approachability, was your great generosity as a leader. You you didn't just lead; you you brought us with you, and that's pretty rare. Hey, Jay. I think the first time we met was during the Novell acquisition due diligence talks, and I met with you for a while and. We talked a little bit about the company and the things we were going to go and do, and then we spent about half the time talking about Jeremy Curley and Andy Dalton and TCU football. And I can remember thinking right then that, man, this is a guy that I'm going to love working with. I think my favorite thing about you, Jay, is your energy. I never left a meeting with you where I felt discouraged. I always felt energized and like we could go and do the things we needed to. That energy is going to be missed, Jay. You're going to be missed. 
Good luck. If you're ever in Park City and you want to get, grab some Thai food, just give me a call. Before I came to work for you, someone came up to me and said, Jay is so nice, but what they failed to tell me was how engaging, congenial, and accessible you are. You always walked around the office, said hello everybody with a big smile. Jay, you made coming to work so enjoyable. I'm going to miss you. I wish you the very best. Cheers. And you were always a very inspirational type of leader. And one day, if I ever have the chance to get in the type of leader position, leadership position as you've had, I would want to be that type of leader, an inspirational leader who led by example. And you were a hard worker. I saw that the whole time you were here. And that's how I want to be one day as well. So I want to leave you with that. Thanks very much for all your leadership. Bye. Good luck. Hi, Jay. Hey, this chapter's come to an end. We're really going to miss you, but I've got some great memories of you out at RSA, at the President's parties, at the National Finals Rodeo in Las Vegas. These are great memories that I'll have always, and I wish you the best of luck in the, in the future, and uh, please keep in touch when you can. See ya. Hey, Jay, this is Tom Crabb. Just wanted to say thank you for all the Good times we've had. Thank, it was great to work with you during events, at Brainshare, at customer events and such. I learned a lot from you, and it's been great working under your leadership. You're a great leader and even a better person. And I wish you all the best in your retirement, and hopefully your golf game gets better and you're able to enjoy time with your family. Good luck. Hi, Jay. From the moment I met you and found out your daughter's name was Alyssa, I knew we were going to hit it off pretty well. I've always enjoyed the way that you've led the people at NetIQ and showed your enthusiasm no matter what we were doing. My favorite memory of you is when we all sang together at the Christmas party a few years ago and your wife Sally came in and taught us all how to sing the very funny song that we all sang. And no matter how people sang, you were encouraging everyone to sing out and sing proud. And um, it was just a really great time. So good luck in all that you do. And we're really gonna miss you around here at NetIQ. Bye. Hey Jay. Just want to wish you the best in your retirement. I think it's, uh, I wanted to say how much I appreciated everything you've done, not just for me personally and professionally, but obviously for the company. I think it's been a quite a ride over the last few years. And uh, I absolutely positively know that you will not have a quiet retirement, that you will find something to do. It's, it's not in your nature to sit still. And uh, we will certainly welcome you back to the Fort Worth office. If you want to come and uh, we'll buy you a coffee here and there, but only one because they are $4.50 at the Starbucks office. But uh, again, just thanks for everything. Want to wish you the best and I definitely hope to see you soon. See you. Hey Jay, just wanted to take this opportunity to say thank you, uh, not only for your leadership of us as a company, but also as a leadership team and certainly for me uh, on a personal level and I think the best way that we can uh, continue your uh, mentorship and your leadership of us as a team is to continue the tradition of focusing on the customer and uh, making that the most important thing or our one thing as we go forward. Uh, thanks for everything you've done and uh, we look forward to staying in touch. I uh, wish you the best in retirement. Uh, thanks again. Jay Milbank here. I wanted to record just a quick video just to say thank you for your leadership and everything that you've brought to the NetIQ organization. I can't believe time has gone by so quickly. It's been uh, five years since you gave me a ring and I came and visited you down in Houston. It feels like yesterday. Um, you know, over that time you know, you've worked with us in the field, other circumstances, and uh, really brought uh, a tremendous uh, amount of value, humor, and um, success to our organization. But I think the greatest thing that uh, I'll always remember about you here in our time together is your sense of humor. I think, uh, you know, one situation, I think we, I got a, I shared a laugh with you about was after you'd visited, you know, about 56 countries, you came back from South Africa and got the Ebola hazmat treatment and you're on the phone with their hospital trying to get your medical records and they would only issue it to your doctor. And having the good identity training that you've gotten in NetIQ, you did ask them the question, 
if you won't release it to me because you don't know it's really me, then how do you know it's really the doctor is who my doctor? And it turned out to be like an Abbott Costello who's on first conversation. But um, you're okay, and um, I'm glad you're now having the time to go do those things you want to do with your family and take on the next stage of adventure in, in your life and really wish you well stay in contact uh, we'll always miss you here and um, I wish you the best send you this quick note you know as a as a leader as a um, uh, a mentor as a friend as a collaborator as someone that provides a lot of inspiration um, and, and most of all um, as a person I've really appreciated everything that you've done for the company. Uh, for me specifically, I've learned so much from you. Um, so I wanted to say thank you and, and best wishes for all that you do. Jay, thank you very much for a number of fantastic years with Vanetta IQ. It was great fun and an honor to work with you and in your management team. Your leadership, your management, your management style, your focus on growth, focus on customer success, uh, for support for the business and specifically the EMEA business that all was the foundation for a number of fantastic years. I want to really thank you for those years. I wish you all the best going forward together with your family and I'm uh, pretty sure we're gonna meet somewhere or in the US or in the Netherlands to drink a beer or to drink a, a, a cup of coffee and to look back to a number of fantastic years which we had together. Thank you very much. Hi Jay, I can't believe it's been five years since we first met. For the moment I met you, I saw a person with passion and understanding for business. That has not changed over the five years we worked together. You've had that passion, you had also respect for humans and for people around you. You empowered people around you and trusted them. Thanks for everything you have done for us to set us in the path for further success. This is absolutely not a goodbye, but more like see you later, because I am sure we'll run into one another and we'll stay in touch. Thank you again for everything. Hey Jay, I wanna say that uh, it's been a hell of a ride working with you. The first time uh, we ran into each other, it was just like we clicked and hit it off, and uh, you were an awesome, awesome executive to work with. I've had, you know, the fair share of, of pain in the butt ones but dude you're a friend I, I consider you as a friend and it's been wonderful wonderful to work with um, I am gonna miss miss you being up on stage and miss being hanging with you and, and actually getting a big old bear hug from you once in a while so anyway my friend uh, congratulations and I hopefully uh, we see you and run into you when you're out here in Park City and out here having fun but dude I, I just want to say it's been a pleasure and I feel privileged to be able to uh, know you and work with you and uh, consider you a friend Cheers, buddy. <laughs> it's a, it's a, it's the break going. after going or is it after going? Yeah. Oh, listen, 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 listen. Improvise. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, there is. You, you guys got it pretty good. 50,000 a year, we'll buy a lot of beer. Things are going great, and they're only getting better. Perfect. All right. That's good. That's good. <laughs>